Waiting isn't good enough. My thoughts exactly. If you have a dream, don't wait. Act. One of life's little rules. Got it memorized? Who are you? Axel. I happen to be an acquaintance of Sora's. Why don't we go see him? Sora? We've got something in common, Kyrie. You and I both miss someone we care about. Hey, I feel like we're friends already. You're not acting very friendly. Hey, what is this place? You okay? <laughs> what? You and that dog came flying out of a hole in the wall. He nearly gave us heart attacks. Sounds like we've got trouble. We'll take it from here. Impressive. By the way, have you seen a man named Axel? I expect he's here somewhere. Like I care. You see, Axel's no longer acting in our best interest. Is he with the organization too? Yes. You have a front? Not a very organized organization. Don't let your guard down. Axel will stop at nothing to turn you into a heartless. Gee, thanks for looking out for us, mister. But I'm sure we can take care of ourselves just fine. Glad to hear it. Axel aside, it would break our hearts to hear something happen to you. Hearts? You don't have any hearts. True, we don't have hearts. But we remember what it was like. That's what makes us special. What do you mean? We know very well how to injure a heart. Sora, you just keep on fighting those heartless. Let's jump in after him. Help him! I'm not sure, but maybe he'll lead us to the organization's world. Don't be reckless. Do you want to end up like Riku? What? Wait! What did he mean, end up like Riku? Hey! How about you get out of my town now? You've caused enough trouble. Riku. Have it your way. Come on, guys. Hold it. Make up your mind. This goes to the strongest guy in Twilight Town. 
Thanks, but we don't really need it. Whoa! Oh, Sora! Um, Pence, right? Do you know a girl named Kyrie? Kyrie? I sure do. Uh, then you better come to the station. So, how do you guys know Kyrie? Kyrie was really here? Yeah. And she said she was looking for you. Tell me where she is! Well... What a romantic story. If you stick around, Sora's bound to show up. Yeah, he said he's coming back. Okay. What took you so long, Kyrie? Somehow, I just knew you'd be here. I tell you, Kyrie, you've got a lot of guts jumping right into the darkness like that. You think it might have been Axel? Sorry. Hey, it's not your fault. Come on, cheer up. Like I can even say that. I gotta help Whoa. Kyrie. That was close. Sora! Are you okay? Huh? What? What what just happened? A new road is open, and Kyrie and Riku are waiting somewhere along it. You'd better hurry then. You coming back? Promise. そう
これで空は迷いためら己の迷いを感じた彼は戸惑う自分自身に怒り迷いを振り切ろうとして今まで以上に力強く前進する我々が望む未来へと一つ気がかりがアクセルか哀れなものだ感じるはずもない友情の幻をいつまで追いかけるのやら失われたものを取り戻せるとでも思っているのかしかるべき哀れみを与えてやれ Do you think? Looks like there's more heartless now. Let's go check in with everyone. I think they're at Merlin's. Oh, Cloud! What you doing? I'll get him. This time, we settle it. Me and the one who embodies all the darkness in me. Ha! I said you get kinda different, Cloud. If I do, it's his fault. Whose? Sephiroth. Tell me if you see him. Okay, what's he look like? Silver hair. Carries a long sword. Sure. Well, be seeing you, Cloud. Be careful. He messes with your head. Makes you think darkness is the only way. Is something wrong? Uh, uh. It's nothing. Hmm? I don't want you involved. You mean, you don't want me there when you go away again? I just... Listen. Even if I go far away, I'll come back. Do you mean it? Yeah. See? You don't look so sure. Well, okay. I understand. Go. Get things settled. Huh? No matter how far away you are, Once you find your light, I'm sure it will lead you back here again. Right? I suppose. So I'll stay here. And I'll cheer for you. Okay, Cloud? Okay. Wonder if he'll be okay. He'll be fine. I'm sure there's some light in him somewhere. You're right. Excuse me, are you with the Restoration Committee? What's Leon's gang up to? They've got stuff to do over by the castle postern. Scoop! Huh? Let's report. To who? Our leader, of course. Yeah, you know. <laughs> Don't mind her. I assure you. We come in peace. You're kidding. Problem? Okay, fine. You do the talking. So sorry about this.
handsome. Gorge! I guess this must be his room. Master Keen! Hello? Hey, you! I'm looking for somebody. Have any of you seen a guy with spiky hair? <laughs> Spikier. I'll just take a look around. <sighs> Sorry to bother you. No, no bother, bother man! man. So you made it. Leon! This is it! Where's Kyrie? Where's Riku? Easy. You wanna break it? Oh. Sorry. Guess I got a little carried away. Whoa! Huh? Whoa! Get off of me! Ha ha ha! Attention, current user. This is a warning. Further misuse of this terminal will result in immediate defensive action. Who's there? I am the master control program. I oversee this system. Where are you? Donald! I'm sorry! Decision gate breached. You are now under arrest. Arrest? Run! Who's boss? Who are you? I am Commander Sark. A heartless commander? Hmm. Observe. Okay, you're the boss. I get it. What is this anyway? You're inside a mainframe computer system. A what system? A computer system for processing data. This system is a copy of one created by a corporation called ENCOM. The original program was destroyed. But this copy was acquired by another user. The new user updated and customized the programs, renaming the system Hollow Bastion OS. 
He used the system for town maintenance and to advance his private research. My name is Tron. I'm a security program. But now I'm under arrest. Same as you. Did you guys get any of that? Gorge! You know, maybe we should just introduce ourselves. I'm Sora. Nice to meet you, Tron. Well, I'm Goofy. With that configuration, you must be users. Users? You'd better get out of here quickly. Who knows what the MCP will do to you? MCP? The Master Control Program. It controls the whole system. If you idle here, you will be derezzed. So, how do we get out of here? This terminal could have gotten you back to the user world. But the MCP cut the power 50 microcycles ago. <sighs> if we could bring the energy core in the canyon online, we could power it back up. The problem is, we're stuck in this cell. We're not going anywhere unless we unlock the energy fields. Master Control, why not just derez Tron? I still haven't located the password to the data space. What about a logic probe? With all your processing power, out of the question. The current environment hampers the processing power needed for such an analysis. You're dismissed, Sark. Stop any remaining anomalies in the system or else. End of line. Acknowledged. energy core. What did you want us to do? Find my user. He'll give you the password to access the DTD. So, um... DTD is the name my user gave to the data space. Copies of all the original system programs are stored there, along with anything that's sensitive or restricted. Is there stuff about the Heartless or Organization 13? Hmm, most likely. number of my functions were appropriated when I last took on the MCP. That's why I need the password. If I can get inside the DTD, I can access my original backup program and restore all my functions. Then I'll be able to put this system back the way it was before the MCP got control and changed everything. The way it was supposed to be. A free system for you, the users. Hmm. Gee, Tron, ain't the MCP one of those programs, too? Do you know who it was who made it? Actually, I don't know. Okay, we'll just have to find your user and ask him. What's his name? You mean you don't know? <laughs> My user is the user of this system. Ansem the Wise. Ansem? Looks like the MCP's on to us. I'll keep this terminal up and running. You better exit the system now! 
Sure, but Tron, Ansem is. We'll get you the password. Okay, you're good to go. Hurry. Excuse me? What's this doodle? Hello. Bad. Security. Drag. Door two. Looks like a diagram or something. Door two. Darkness. Oh. D. T. D. 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 What's up? Look at this. This must be the data space. The DTD. See? The door to darkness. What do you know? But that still leaves the password. Say, fellas, did somebody mention the door to darkness? Your Majesty! <laughs> Long time no see. Shh. The organization might be listening. You mentioned the door to darkness? Oh, uh, yes, sir. You see, we're looking for the secret password. Password? Oh, I guess you mean like a code. Well, the door to darkness can only be opened by the seven princesses. There's Snow White, Jasmine, and Belle. Of course. What are you trying to do? With that password, we can get access to Ansem's research data. So that means you might be able to find out where he is. Uh, stop joking around, Your Majesty. We already defeated Ansem. You know that. Well, looks like I've got a lot of explaining to do. Well, this is Your Majesty. Okay, but first I've got a question. Hey, isn't Tron waiting for you guys? Don't worry, I'm not going anywhere. If those Heartless attack, I'll stand and fight with everybody here. Yeah, we will too. Then let's talk more later. That's a promise. I'll see you when you get back. Touch nothing. Welcome to the Game Grid. Game Grid? That's right. You've been chosen to play a few games. Lose and you will be subject to immediate de-resolution. Win? Well... <laughs> no one wins. We're not gonna play your games. You have no choice. Well then, get on with it. Alright! 
It looks like we can escape through there! I don't understand. Why are you here? We came to give you the password. Why didn't you just transmit the data? Transmit? Hey, are you okay? I'll be alright. Once we access the DTD. Good as new! All my functions have been restored! Oh boy! Finally! I have full access to the DTD. My takeover of the system is now complete. I might have anticipated such a simple password. What's this? An emergency destruct program for the town. Let's see how it performs. No! Uh -huh. Program, you changed the password. There, that should buy us some time. Tron, tell us what's going on. The MCP's loading a hostile program into the I.O. tower. What do we do? We've got to protect the user town. Let's head to the tower. I'm disappointed in you, program. Why do you insist on allying with these selfish users? Because I want to help them. Something written into my code commands me to do what is right. Really? And what command would that be? I can't really say for sure. Friends, they help each other, that's all. Uh oh, look out! With all my functions up and running, I think I've got a chance of getting system control away from the MCP. Now, I'd better get to work. It's what my user would want. What Ansem would want. Listen, Tron. We didn't get the password from Ansem. We just sort of found it, back in the user world, by accident. And one more thing, Ansem, he was our enemy. I mean, he still is, I guess. Well, actually, he's my enemy, too. What do you mean? Ansem took Encom's original system and customized it for his own use. I was part of the original system, and Ansem modified me, too. So, that makes him my user. But Ansem is also the one who brought back the MCP. The Ansem I first knew wouldn't do that. I'm sorry I didn't tell you. That's okay, but now I really don't get it. I don't understand it either. 
But I think users like you are going to be the ones who will finally figure it out. You have the ability to take illogical routes and still arrive at the answers you seek. Now go, before the MCP starts acting up again. Any data you need from the DTD can be accessed directly through my user's terminal. I'll keep a dedicated access channel open for you. I changed the password, so you won't have to worry about the MCP for a while. Access channel? <laughs> I knew you'd ask. It's a very important link between our worlds. It's how we stay connected. You, my friends, are the new password. Thanks, Tron. Take care. You too. And give my best to the users. Well, that's that. Look. Tron, hang in there. So, where do we start? I know. Let's access the DTD. The King's checking the situation in town. He'll be back soon, so don't worry. Hey, look. It's asking for a password. That's easy, it's... Sora! Goofy! That's... to the point. Well... That did it. We're in. I have to go into town. Need to see what that last shake-up did. You're not gonna check out the data? It wasn't exactly easy to get. I'm coming right back. Hey, Sora. Why don't you get started unloading the data and copying it down? It's just a few keystrokes. Easy, right? Hey, these things take time, okay? Whoa, it's doing something. Huh? I think it wants to know what we want to know. Riku and Kairi. No way. Even Ansem's computer doesn't know. I thought I'd ask the computer if it can tell us about them nobodies. What's this? The data is corrupt. How about the organization? There! The data is corrupt. Stupid computer! Oh. Huh? Who's this guy? Well, I see you got things working. Oh, oh your, your majesty. majesty. Good going. The computer should tell us the things we need to know. But it keeps on saying the data inside's all kerscuffled. All we got is a picture of some guy we don't know. Ansem the Wise. Come on, are you teasing us again? Can you forget what Ansem looked like, your majesty? Of course I do, and this is him. I'm positive. Huh? Excuse me, could you come this way, please? Look, this is Ansem. You know, the guy we all worked really hard to defeat? Oh, that's right. I never finished explaining. What? Well, the man in the picture is definitely the one who tried to take over Kingdom Hearts. The one you fellas defeated. But 
what you actually thought was his heartless. You see, he wasn't really handsome. He just went around telling everybody that he was. You mean... Yeah. What? <laughs> we went through all that trouble to defeat an imposter? Yup, a fake. But he still had to be stopped. Uh, I can't believe it. Oh, I'm kind of confused. If he's a fake, then what happened to the real Ansem? Welp, that's just what I'm trying to figure out. Ansem the Wise should know all about Organization 13's plans and what's been happening to the worlds. I'm pretty sure he'll give us some help. You know, I came close to finding him once. Hmm. Don't tell me there's more. I'm lost enough as it is. Well, let's see. Some feller named Ansem, who wasn't really Ansem, became a Heartless. Does that mean a nobody got created when that happened too? Yup. And that nobody is the leader of the organization. What? what? I know I've met this fake Ansem before, and I've seen the leader of Organization 13 too. Hmm, kind of felt like being around the same fella. So, where did you meet this guy? Gosh, I can't remember. Ansem the Wise, the real Ansem, must know the imposter's true identity. That's why I've got to find him and ask him about it. You. You started all of this. Because of you, Riku and Kairi. Oh, Your Majesty, do you know where Riku is? He's... <sighs> I'm sorry, I can't help. Really, Your Majesty? Are you sure? I'm sorry, Sora. What about Kairi? Organization 13 might have kidnapped her. Oh, no! Sora, Donald, Goofy. I was planning to go get help from Ansem the Wise, but now I know I forgot the most important thing. Helping others should always come before asking others for help. We're safe and sound and free to choose. So there's no reason we shouldn't choose to help our friends. Let's look for Riku and Kairi together. Outside! Sounds like we gotta start by helping out here! me, my heartless. Attack the white husks. Sweep them away. What are you, nuts? We're never gonna win. I don't know about you, but I'm out of here, sister. You pathetic coward. Leave the White Ones! Turn your attention to Sora and his friends! Uh-oh! Where's Maleficent? Looks like she ran away. Well, that was pretty lame of her. I guess we picked the wrong side. 
Um, hey, if you're looking to pick sides, why don't you pick Leon's? They can always use help. Does this Leon have any treasure? Yeah, lots of stuff. Perfect! Come on. Who are you? Oh, we're nothing worth mentioning. Just three treasure fanatics. Later, taters! Did Leon really have any treasure? Time for you. Sephiroth the one who's supposed to be the dark part of Cloud's heart? Huh. Did Cloud tell you that? Then he must understand now. Just what are you gonna do to him? Nothing. Cloud is the one who hungers for darkness. He said he's got a score to settle with you. I see. He wants to meet me again. Then I should give him what he wants. That last bit of light is always the hardest to snuff out. King's in the Bailey. You better head over there. Got it. Think you can handle this many? Well, it might be tough if one more shows up. Hmm. Then that'll have to be the one I take care of. What? You're fine too? <laughs> Sir, 
Sephiroth! I understand that you've been looking for me. Yeah. Once I get rid of you, the darkness will go away. Can you do it? That darkness comes from your own dark memories. Do you think you can erase your past? Shut up! Face it. You turn your back on the present and live in the past. Because the light of the present is too much. You don't know me! Cloud! I know. Because... I am you. Cloud! Wait! Huh? Leon, everybody, hang in there. Okay, fellas, you've got to go find Riku and Kairi. But Leon and the others are friends, too. Don't worry, there's already lots of help here. We'll take care of this fight. But I promised Leon. Donald, Goofy, take Sora and get going. Riku. Kyrie, give me a little time, okay? We understand. We'll go search for Riku and Kyrie. Right. Watch for danger. You'll be careful too. Wait, you guys. Sora, do as you're told. You're coming with us whether you want to or not. Come on, Sora. You gotta be good. Gotcha. Well then, skedaddle! Let's go! Whoa! I'm sorry, Your Majesty. Oh. Hope you can forgive us.
アンセム様先日提案させていただいた新しい実験の許可をいかん扉と世界の心のことは忘れろあれは触れてはならない領域だしかしアンセム様私の考えではゼアノートその考えは忘れてしまえ何ですか創造しゼムナス殿はどこだいつもの場所へ眠りの部屋か急ぎのようなら行ってみてはいかがです冗談はよせやむを得んお戻りを待つかええー、一刻も惜しいというのに全く用がある時に限ってこうだ間が悪いという俺もあそこは苦手なんだよなお前はどうだい同志ゼクシオン殿盗み聞きですか何をしているのですあなたとザルディンの任務は新たな同志を探すことこんなところで怠けている余裕はないはずですが仕事は十分やってるさ昨日も一人見つけてきたんだ確かマーナンとかって名前になったらしいなこれで期間も11人結構な数が揃ったもんさだもんで今日だけレクセウスに代理を頼んで休んでるって話明日のお仕事のためになではせいぜい英気を養うのですね僕には今日の仕事がありますのでこれでお堅いね楽しくお話でもしようぜ例えばゼウナスの秘密についてだ。あれは何年前だったかな鍵型の剣を手にした奴らがこの地に現れ、すげえ戦いをやらかした。そいつらが姿を消した後、記憶をなくした男が倒れてた。ゼウナス。いや。ゼアノートがアンセムに拾われたのはちょうどその頃だったよな。それが何か眠りの部屋。そう、俺たちが心の闇を研究していた地下施設。賢者アンセムの命令で封印された墓は、おせっかいな賢者を追放したゼムナスが最初にやったのは、封印を解いた施設の奥にあの部屋をこしらえることだった。以来、ちょくちょく部屋にこもって、誰かと話していらっしゃる。妙だろう部屋にはゼムナス一人のはずだ。盗み聞きがお好きのようですね。話の中身までは聞こえねえさ。おかげで余計気になってな。お前も興味あるだろ僕は自分の任務に専念したいだけです。あなたも本来の任務に注力して、もっと同志を集めてください。新たな施設の準備を急がねばならないのに、期間が11人だけでは手が足りません。新たな施設ああ、忘却の城ね。あんなの使ってゼムナスは何する気だろうな。僕らが聞かされた目的は、
誰にも聞かせていない目的がある。眠りの部屋と対をなす目覚めの部屋もう一つの墓場そいつを探してるのさゼムナスじゃない誰かが作った部屋をなそこにはきっともう一人友がいる。Hey, you guys are looking lively. Scrum! Didn't we catch you messing around in the underworld? How'd a wimp like you get into Organization 13? <laughs> I bet you can't even fight. Yeah, but we can. You shouldn't judge anyone by appearance. Oh, I told them they were sending the wrong guy. Who is this kook? Remember, the organization's made up of nobodies. Right. No hearts. Oh, we do too have hearts. Don't be mad. You can't trick us! Silence, traitor. Anyone from the organization who'd like to be next? Hey, Sora! Go ahead, tell the last one. Yeah, we gotta go help our friends out first. Oh, sorry. Then let's go! Aha! There you are! You sure have lots of friends to help. So, I guess we better all pull together and finish this battle for good. Yes, yes Your Majesty! Come on, wake up! I'm sorry about the ice cream! Goofy? Uh, uh, Goofy! This is not happening. It can't be happening. It can't. They'll pay for this. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine, but... I'm guilty. Hey, fellas! 
Goofy! Goofy! You know, that really hurt. Aw, Goofy. Of course, Your Majesty. I get bumped on the head all the time. <laughs> with them. Hey! You mean it's his nobody? The leader of Organization 13. Wait a minute. Now I know. Wise Ansem, I'm here to seek your advice. I'm glad we have the opportunity to speak like this, my friend. I'm intrigued by your hypothesis and I'm finding it difficult to stave off the urge to test it. Still, I'm concerned about the stability of the worlds. Yep, that's what worries me too. The doors that appeared, the place the heartless seek. I fear my research may have brought this upon us. Master Ansem, regarding the experiment I presented the other day, with your permission, I'd like to proceed. I forbid it! Forget this talk of doors and the heart of all worlds. That place must not be defiled. But Master Ansem, I've been thinking... They are not. Those thoughts are best forgotten. Remember, Xehanort, Ansem's apprentice. The leader of Organization 13 is Xehanort's nobody. Let's go! Move it! We can't let Xehanort get away! Right! Where's the king? Come on! Your Majesty! Xehanort! How long has it been since I abandoned that name? Out with it, nobody! Where's Kyrie? Where's Riku? I know nothing of any Kyrie. As for Riku, 
Perhaps you should ask your king. He's gone. Show our duty. What's going on? Way to fall right into their trap. Come on, it's a setup by Organization 13. Xemnas is using you to destroy the Heartless. That's his big master plan. Xemnas? The guy you just saw. He's their leader. Got it memorized? X-E-M-N-A-S. Organization 13 wants to get rid of the Heartless? Man, you're slow. Every Heartless slain with that Keyblade releases a captive heart. That is what the organization is after. So what do those guys gonna do with the hearts? I'm not telling. Tell us! You! You're the one who kidnapped Kyrie! Bingo. The name's Axel. Got it memorized. Where is Kyrie? Please, just tell me! Look, about Kyrie, I'm sorry. Axel! Uh-oh! We'll ensure he receives the maximum punishment. I don't care about any of that! Just let me into the Realm of Darkness, okay? If it's Kyrie you're worried about, don't. We're taking very good care of her. Take me to her. Is she that important to you? Yeah, more than anything. Show me how important. Please. So, you really do care for her? In that case, the answer's no. You rotten! Are you angry? Do you hate me? Then take that rage and direct it at the Heartless. Pitiful Heartless. Mindlessly collecting hearts. And yet, they know not the true power of what they hold. The rage of the Keyblade releases those hearts. They gather in darkness, masterless and free, until they weave together to make kingdom hearts. And when that time comes, we can truly, finally exist. What in the world do you think you're prattling on about? Kingdom Hearts belongs to me. The heart of all kingdoms. The heart of all that lives. A dominion fit to be called Kingdom Hearts must be my dominion! Maleficent, no! No more Heartless! I do not take orders from you! at bay, you devise a way to vanquish them forever. Maleficent. 
Do not misunderstand me. I shall have my revenge on you yet. Maleficent! Leave now! I don't take orders from you! But what about... Now then, where did we leave off? Which side are you guys on, anyway? The Heartless ally with whoever's the strongest. Yes, Sora. Extract more hearts. Maybe everything we've done, maybe it was all for nothing. What am I supposed to do if I can't use the Keyblade? Imbeciles! You can't be trusted to do anything. Huh? Sora! Donald! Goofy! Relax. Those three aren't going down that easily. The Keyblade's chosen one. He's a lucky kid. See you soon. Maybe everything we've done, maybe it was all for nothing. What am I supposed to do if I can't use the Keyblade? Imbeciles! You can't be trusted to do anything. Huh? What's this place? It must be the Realm of Darkness. Kairi! Riku! Are you sure you want to open... That? Gorge! It's the gang from Twilight Town! There's Hainer, Pence, Olette, and, uh, um... Roxas. No. The name just popped into my head. This is... Roxas. Are you sure you want to eat that? Chunky, no, sweet.
Not yet. I gotta look for Kyrie. I wonder how everybody's doing. Work! Wait! Sora! Mulan, hey, no time to talk. We gotta catch that guy. I'm following him too. Then let's go! Looks like he got away. How come you're after somebody from Organization 13? What is that? The guy in black. One of the bad guys! I knew it. There's a rumor in the Imperial City about a spy in black lurking in the mountains. I'd been up here tracking him, but when you arrived, I lost him. Ah. Oh. Sorry. Don't apologize, but I do wonder where he went. Again? Okay, first things first. Hey, you! Quit sneaking around! Did you get him? Hmm. No. Oh. He's gone. What? You lost him? Anyway, what now? Well, I think that we better get rid of all the Heartless first. What was that? Come on, we better get off the mountain. Okay. Shang! Open up! 
Over here! Riku? Ah? Uh? Oh? No, never heard of him. Once again, you have served China well. It would please me to reward you. What is it that you wish? Well... You say a guy in black came to see you. What did he say? That is all you request? Yes. Dragons have crossed our land and left a great web of paths. These dragons wield much power, and they are the source of many gifts to both man and nature. But it would seem someone of evil intent disturbed one of our dragons and transformed it into what you call a heartless. It is my belief that this young man came to warn me of that danger. Then I could alert and prepare my troops. Did you? <laughs> I was about to, but he told me the situation had changed. He said three wise guys had arrived, and they would take care of things. <laughs> That's gotta be Riku! But what's he doing hanging out with Organization 13? No idea, but at least I finally know he's okay. That's good enough. Now then, Famula, do you have a request? I'd like Shang... Uh, I mean, well, the captain. 
Yes, yes, my dear, what is it? Could the captain have a vacation, please? <laughs> I hardly expected such humble requests. In this case, I'm afraid I must refuse. Captain Lee's responsibility is to protect the Emperor. And yet, Mulan... Yes. Would you like to serve alongside him and protect me? Huh? What? Two reeds together are stronger than one. But the choice is yours alone. Thank you, Your Excellency. Tonight goes well. So do I. But I wonder why he's so nervous. The master does have his shy side, you know. Tonight is very important. Oh, maybe we came at a bad time. Well, there's only one way to find out. Donald! Monsieur, Mademoiselle, please enjoy the evening. And of course, our honored guests are welcome too. A uh, welcome indeed. The organization! You don't know when to quit. Oh yeah, well sure yeah. Get out! Not tonight. I've come to take something you hold very dear. Yes, let your anger grow. Beast, we have to get rid of these guys first. What's wrong? Please calm down. Calm down? You just had to have a party, didn't you? Don't you see what's happened? Hey, what's with you? The rose. My rose. What? That? He took it? But surely you can find another rose. Silence! You don't know anything! That's not fair, Beast. Don't take it out on Belle. It's not like she stole it. <sighs> I'm sorry. You don't have to apologize. But... Belle... Sora... I want you to leave the castle. Look at 
me. Look, this is what I am. When you first got here, I tried to change. But I was only fooling myself. I can't be any different. I'll always be a beast, so I should live like a beast. With no one alone. Goodbye, Belle. You can't mean that. Oh, I think his mind's all made up. Yeah. Look, Belle, leave this to us. If we can get the beast's rose back, he'll calm down. Hey, beast! <sighs> Leave me alone. Come on, you need to hear this. You used to be fearless. You would have given your life to save Bell. Don't you know what that meant to us? You gave us all courage! Hmm. <laughs> Maybe you should have kept some for yourself. I mean, are you really gonna throw your happiness away? The Rose is your only hope, isn't it? Well, it's the only hope for Cogsworth and the others, too. So don't throw away your last chance. Remember what it was like before Bell lived here? See? You can't give up. Not now. I know one thing. What? This castle belongs to me. Zaldin will never be welcome here. So, Beast, you came after all. You had me worried. I was afraid you'd given up for good. What do you guys really want? Kingdom Hearts. When Kingdom Hearts is ours, we can exist fully and completely. So you see, Beast. That's why we need your Heartless and your Nobody. Hmm. Pleasure. But I'd rather travel light. What shall I leave behind? 
bell or the rose. Good one, Bell. Here, it's yours again. Belle? I know. You want me to leave the castle. <sighs> what matters is, you weren't hurt by Zaldan. You're safe. And, um, I'm very grateful to you for bringing the rose back to me. Hmm. Thank you. It's the least I could do. You've been good to me, and you didn't have to be. Listen, Belle. Yes? <sighs> Say it. Go on. Come on. You can do it. We have confidence. Don't be bashful, Mal. Well, I'd like you to stay with me, please. I will. My strong music. Hey, did you see the look on Belle's face when she grabbed that rose? Huh? Yup, she sure was having fun, all right. She is rather unique, isn't she? Always ready for a little adventure. Two of them do seem made for each other. Yeah, they sure do. Jack! Uh, Zola, some assistance? That's Sora, Donald, and Goofy. Will you leave a mate to perish? Aye, aye. Interceptor off the starboard bow! Woo! Stop that, Jack! We've got to rescue him! Happened. The medallions and the stone chest. Someone's taken them. 
Next thing I knew, we were attacked. But I couldn't see who it was. His face was shrouded in a black hood. The organization. We found a way out of the cave. But the villains sent a horde of terrible creatures after us. I've never seen their likes before. I think I'm the only one who made it back to the ship. Will. Elizabeth, I feel rather... Uh... Our turn, guys. You'd best go prepared. We've no idea what's out there. Pardon me, lads and lass, but your captain will have no monsters today. Thank you. We're turning for home. Just like that? Just like that. Don't remember inviting you. So it was the organization. We'll handle this. Huh? The darkness of men's hearts. Drawn to these cursed medallions. And this heartless. A veritable maelstrom of avarice. I wonder, are they worthy to serve Organization 13? And you want an answer now? Precisely. Not over yet. <laughs> Throw him overboard. Aye, aye. Holly! Excuse me? Barley? It's a bit of the pirate's code. Anyone who invokes parley must not be harmed till negotiations are complete. This is no time for rules. The true. But as we're honorable pirates, we should always stick to the code. All right, you. Out with it. I surrender the chest with my humblest apologies. Rather accommodating of you, mate. And for that you want... Just a few souvenirs. For the memories. Huh? Oh no! We can't stop the curse unless we got all the medallions! Our friend's about to learn what it means to cross a pirate. Oh. Donald, Goofy, he's yours. You stole a medallion again? Were I only that fortunate? Fortunate? So, uh, how come you're all skeleton-y? Perhaps I got a touch of something from that monster what attacked us. Yet, why is the skin resting right on you three? Cause we're not greedy! What do you get to that? That still doesn't solve the mystery. Gorge. Maybe the reason we're all okay is because we're not from this world. There must be different laws. Yeah. We're always just passing through. Wonder when we'll see home again. Sure. <laughs> just kidding you. Lucky we didn't get cursed, huh? Quit yammering, mates. We've got to find ourselves a ship that'll float. Now 
Marion! Get it! Three more to go. How do you know? A pirate must have a keen eye, else he won't be sailing free for very long. Savvy? Ridiculous imitation, and yet, I'm flattered. That's four medallions. We got them all. But where's the chest? If we find the hooded man, we'll find it. Probably in Port Royal. Why's that? Organization 13 is after people's hearts. So they're gonna go wherever there's lots of people. They'll hurt the townsfolk? No, they're bringing them flowers, mate. I don't know who these organizers are, but I will say they're making we pirates look like proper gents. Well, Jack. Then... We have to help. Then let go and hold a run free! Now to break that curse. Then what's this? Oh, I understand. Jack must have been cursed by that monster, not from taking the gold. Oh, I've no worries then. It's okay, Jack. We'll just have to defeat the monster, that's all. To go. All better, and not quite, mate. Sora! Bravo! Just who was that chap? He is part of an organization that's collecting hearts. First, they release Heartless into different worlds. We defeat those Heartless, then they get the hearts. We're never gonna stop them like this. What's the plan, then? We gotta find their stronghold and finish them off, once and for all. Sail in these waters, I've heard some tales, but not a one like this. Is there any way we can help? Hmm... Anything at all. There is. It's certain we don't need the likes of that hooded fellow and the heartless about. They'll ruin the market for us true pirates. So that's why you went to Port Royal. And we thought you actually wanted to save everyone. A pirate always looks to profit, Miss Swan. Too bad. You had us going there thinking you'd turned over a new leaf. The question is, what's beyond the leaf, Savvy? Oh, oh yes. A reward. And what'll it be? That lovely blade of Sora's. Huh? Okay, sure. Hold on, that was far too easy. Uh, what's the rub? Now ah, there you see. Well, you've always got the pearl, Jack. That I do. But someday I'll gather a bloodthirsty crew and come to take that blade. Chance by then, I'll have the way to wield it. And if I succeed, 
I'll ask you two to join me. That'd be reward enough. Done. Maybe someday Jack will be able to use the Keyblade after all. Where's that? <laughs> he and Sora are kind of alike, don't you think? Are not. <laughs> <laughs> Some say Jack Sparrow's the worst pirate ever to sail the Spanish main. No one could really mean that. Right. We know he's the best. I hope we'll get to see him again. Hey. Herc, you feeling any better? Well, same routine. Wonder Boy here thinks his hero days are over. And Phil thinks it's all in his head. Gorsh, Herc, we know you're a hero. That's right. <laughs> Blunder Boy. How can you mope on a momentous day like today? The Underdrome's back, and you are gonna fill the stands. After all, your fans won't settle for anything less than a certified hero. I mean, if you're not up to it, you could always just, I don't know, lose. I bet you'd like that. Excuse me? Hey, I'm not a selfish guy. I'm not like those high and mighty snobs up on Olympus. I stand for the masses. And have I got a massive idea. The games, ladies and gentlemen, are back. Yours truly, Hades, the one and only Lord of the Dead, brings you the ultimate games to celebrate the reopening of the ultimate Colosseum. We'll finally answer the age-old question, who deserves the title Ultimate Hero? These games are gonna settle the debate once and for all. The winner reigns supreme. Of what? You guessed it, the Hades Cup! And I assure you that the great Hercules will be there, otherwise, You'll never see your girlfriend again. Low life. <laughs> You're too kind, kid. Okay, let's review. State your crime, prisoner. I exist. That is my crime. It is inexcusable. Ooh, good. Very good. What's wrong with Orin? He's never acted that way before. Shh. Okay, so you made one lousy mistake. You exist. But hey, I'm a forgiving guy. You keep your end of our little deal, and I'm willing to overlook a transgression or two. I understand. Defeat Hercules. And his meddling friends. What? No. Only Hercules. Ah. Oh. Don't tell me you've forgotten who's in charge. Oh. Hercules and the other three. Are we clear? We're clear, Hades. Lord Hades. Lord Hades. Good. Now go. So that's how he's controlling Orin. What's wrong, Sora? Oh, Orin's in trouble. It's like Hades brainwashed him. He's using some kind of a statue. You know something? That sounds kind of familiar. Hmm. Hades may be using the statue to hold Orin's free will hostage. What do we do? See if you can find that statue. It's got to be somewhere in the underworld. Right. I'm on it. Tell me you're not thinking of leaving. You've got a match coming up. I'll fight Orin in the final. One-on-one. -on -one. Oh, you will. 
Hmm. I'll draw things out to buy you time. Hmm. But... Just hurry back. I know you can do it. Congratulations. You've got a deal. Thanks. On one condition. The Keyblader here and his trusty friends have to meet the winner in one final clash. What do you say? That'll drive the crowd wild. It better. I promise the crowd the event of their afterlives. <laughs> yeah, sucker. You know, for me, the rest is smooth sailing. <laughs> is entertainment! Got it! It is not too late. Let us turn back. But I, Where is the sense in all this? There must be another way. Your deaths will mean nothing. You must live. I get it. This is what belongs in Orin's heart. Gorge, he must have had a pretty rough life. Yeah, but in the end, that's really what made him stronger. Let's give a back! Nobodies? Where did they come from? Not what I had in mind, but I'll take it. We better ski battle. Mutual agreement. I can give you a clean slate, but you gotta work with me. Maybe you didn't hear me. This is my story, and you're not part of it. That's it! This game is over. I've played by the rules so far. Okay, I confess. I was hoping Wonder Boy would lose, but it was still a fair fight. Come on! Is that really so wrong? Huh? Really? A <laughs> fair fight? <laughs> laugh, laugh, laugh all you want! <laughs> Cause the laughing is about to stop! You wanna know why? Because now we're gonna play by my rules. I warned you right at the get-go. You don't compete, you lose the girl. No! Meg! Hang on! Looks like Wonder Boy has dropped out of the stand. Well, you've still got us to deal with. Oh, 
Yeah, this is gonna be good. <laughs> we can't win. Because it's his underworld. Gee, then how do we beat him? I think a true hero should be able to help. But you... I owe you one, Hades. I didn't hesitate to give my life for Megs, and then I remembered. A true hero is measured by the strength of his heart. I'll never forget that again. Just no more crazy stunts. People always do crazy things when they're in love. <laughs> <laughs> what is so funny, you imbeciles? How dare you get a happy ending? How dare you? others. But now, there's no one left to protect. Maybe it's time I shaped my own story. Yeah, you deserve it, Orin. After everything you've been through. <laughs> I suppose I should thank you. Not at all. Fine. I mean, sure, you could thank us a little. You should say what you mean. I guess I could spare a few words. Thanks for meddling. Hey, what's that mean? Thanks again, guys. You're the best. Excuse us for meddling! Oh, sounds like somebody's feathers are a little ruffled. I'm kidding. Thank you, Sora, Donald, Goofy. So where are you guys headed next? Uh, you know. You two lovebirds seem to be getting along just fine without us hanging around. Go. Uh huh. Before we start meddling. <laughs> yep. Right. Are you turkeys trying to put me out of a job? If you keep acing every challenge, champ, who am I gonna train? Aw, oh, you can't abandon me now, Phil. I gotta be at the top of my game in case Hades shows up again. Hell, I mean, cool. He was what? Yeah. Come on, Phil. How about it? Let me see now. Well, you're not wise enough. Not quite seasoned enough. Okay, okay, we get the hint. Look, kid, it's not my call. Ah, fool. Course if it was, you'd have no problem. I'd make you all heroes, in a heartbeat. Really? Say it again. On second thought, if those are your hero faces, you still got a lot of work to do. Oh, what do you mean? Go away! Phil! Leave me alone! See that? Well, what do you know?
<sighs> What's going on? Can't believe it! That stupid peddler let you far out of the lamp! You far? <laughs> Give me the magic lamp, Aladdin! And now, street rats, I bid you farewell! Crush those urchins! <laughs> <laughs> what a disaster! We're just gonna have to turn back! There's gotta be a way. Ah, oh, come, come on, kid! On, kid. That's, an That's an easy one! Easy one. Ow, oh buddy, oh pal! This is what having a genie for a best friend is all about! I mean, how can you leave me on the sidelines at a time like this? Live large! Wallamel! Give me old razzmatazz, what do you say, kid? Hey, genie! Sora! Wanna see a little something I call sandstorm sweep? Oh, oh boy! Yeah. Take it away, genie! Alakazam! You know, one lousy sandstorm is just too easy. Wow! How about giving me a challenge next time, AL? Now what do we do? Nice timing, Carpet! Jafar! You sure this is it? Yeah, well. You gotta understand! It wasn't my idea! It was Jafar! He made me bring you here! You don't know him like I do! He can be very convincing! He said if I didn't cooperate, he was gonna... Where is he? Come on, Al, you gotta forgive me! Where's Jafar? Well, uh, let's see. Right about now, he's probably attacking the palace. I had no choice! His eyes, they got all creepy and weird. Whatever. Iago, you're supposed to be our friend. But you've been playing both sides, just to make sure you save yourself. I knew you were still a bad guy. I'm sorry! Get some rest, Carpet. You earned it. Come on, let's get you far! And who asked you? The palace is through there. Hurry!
Just wait, Jafar. You'll get exactly what's coming to you. Indeed I will, princess. All of Agrabah will belong to me, while you... <laughs> you, my queen, shall weep at my side for all eternity. Oh, please. Uh, right about now, your precious Aladdin is whispering your name with his last breath. Hmm? Ah, what was that you were saying, Jafar? You dare defy me, you useless bird! <gasps> Iago! You'll all be joining him very soon! Don't mess with street rats. You went mano a mano with Jafar and you didn't invite me, El? Sorry, Genie. Things happen kind of fast. And I had some new moves to show off, too. Now, Genie, you still need your help. Who's gonna fix Agrabah? Oh, yeah! Well, Super Duper spruced up Agrabah coming right up. You won't even recognize the place when I'm through with it. Just like it was, please. Really? Same old, same old. All right. Oh, yeah! Next time, let me put in a few swimming pools, okay? <sighs> I guess Agrabah's all right now. Yeah, thanks, guys. Hey, you behave yourself. Got it? I most definitely got it. No more looking out for number one. I'm reformed! I want to be a good friend like Genie, but I can't do anything to help you. What kind of a friend is that? Oh, no. It's not like that, Iago. Friends don't have to do stuff. As long as we have fun hanging out together, that's all that matters. So, what do you guys do for fun? We Uh, that's not quite what I meant. Well, anyway... Ow, my feet! Gorsh, Iago! I hope you didn't hurt yourself. Well, <laughs> at least I can still fly. Look out! Whoa! Oh, oh, oh. oh! Was that my cue? Am I on? Come on, Al! Let me build a freeway or something! Uh, everything's fine. Don't panic. Genie? But I can't hold it any longer! <laughs> oh, that's good! <laughs> Sora, Donald, Goofy, you guys are too much. If you're ever in the mood for some more cosmic razzle-dazzle, give me a shout, okay? You got it! Well, you've done it again, Sora. Don't forget about us, okay? I won't. And Sora, about that friend of yours, the one you're looking for, you'll find him. Trust me.
There's nothing wrong with my design. It's flawless. There must be something wrong with the parts those imbeciles brought me. I need to find better assistance. Perfect timing, gentlemen. Lend me a hand, won't you? These presents must belong to Sandy Claus, so I thought I'd better return them. You just happened to find them? Of course, Sora. I'm finished with Christmas fantasies, you know that. But you thought you'd hold on to the suit. What, this? It's just a costume. And Sally worked so very hard making it. Come on, we've got work to do. Oh! Wherever did you find these? In Halloween Town. You'll be needing them for Christmas, right, Sandy? Of course. But these are just a few of the Christmas presents that were stolen. Stolen? Oh, Sandy, you don't think it was me? Still wearing the outfit, I see. I just thought I'd dress for the occasion. But, if you don't believe me, then we'll just have to find out who really did it. Very well, I'll leave it to you. All right, Sora, Donald, Goofy, we're off! Looks good. No! Boring! This one? No! No way! So you three took them. Took what? You stole the presents, didn't you? It wasn't us. But... It really sounds like fun! Run, Run for it! it! You can't be here! Leave Halloween Town by order of the mayor! Somebody! Anybody! I'm only an elected official! I can't handle this by myself! Sally was right! We've got to get the presents! What a shame. It looks like it was such a nice present. Uh, Jack. Oh, help! Someone help me! My latest experiment is gone! It's been stolen! Not quite. There's more? Don't worry, I'll take care of the rest. Hmm. 
Did you finish making the presents? Yep, just waiting for Jack. So, uh, where do you think we ought to leave them? Hmm. Oh, I know a good spot. Whenever you're ready, just say the word. I'm back. This plaza should work well for your plan. Now, Jack, what is your plan? I've got it all figured out. You do? Of course. And I also have a wonderful idea. If we catch the thief for you, I would be honored to deliver the crew. And on that note, we'll be going. What are you doing? Let me go! It's not me, Donald. Patience, friends. Shh. I from the world. Gorge, was that you? How come we have to be the bait? Good plan, eh? Ouch! Huh? Dr. Finkelstein's experiment did it! We did it! The mystery is solved! Did you catch the thief? Naturally. I just can't figure out why the doctor's experiment would go around stealing Christmas presents. His experiment? The thief. It was a moving puppet made by Dr. Finkelstein. Hmm. The doctor has made a moving puppet. I see. He is always tinkering with things. Now listen, Jack. I'd like to thank you, and while delivering presents is something only I can do, I can give you an idea of what it's like. Sandy Claus? Yes, all that poor puppet wanted was a heart. Ho, ho, ho! Interesting. So, the puppet wasn't stolen after all. It ran away on its own. In other words, my experiment was an overwhelming success. Santa Claus thinks maybe it left because it was trying to find a heart. That's quite possible. Unlike my Sally, it wasn't equipped with a heart. But if it wanted a heart, why was it going around stealing all those Christmas presents? Maybe because presents are a way to give your heart to someone special. Hmm. When you put it that way, I feel sort of bad for it. Happy Halloween! What a nice present. I don't understand. There's no box. No ribbon tied in a bow. Jack, it's not about the box or the ribbons. It's about what's inside the box. No, Sora. What really counts, what's really special, is the act of giving the gift. To wish deep in your heart to make someone else happy. Right. Of course. Thank you, Sally. You're absolutely right. Wait, what's this? I feel so strange, so very happy.
Jack, that must be Sally's present. Really? This wonderful feeling? Oh, Sally. You've given me the nicest present in the world. And I've nothing to give you in return. What would you like? Just name it. Absolutely anything. The nicest present I could ever ask for, Jack, is just to be with you. You don't even have to ask for that. Oh! <laughs> Maybe I never gave her a real present after all. Oh, I bet Kyrie would like most anything you gave her. I know. That's what made it so hard to decide. It's not the gift, it's what's in your heart. My heart. You bet. Tell me that, Sally. How? Well, as long as she can be with you, what else does she need? It's you guys. Man, we were hoping you were a meal. Hiya. Don't give me any of that Hiya stuff. Thanks to you clowns, we're back to scavenging scraps for a living. <laughs> Come on, it's not that bad. I enjoyed that weak dead elephant we had yesterday. Hey, how's Simba? <laughs> <laughs> we gotta laugh every time we hear that dude's name. <laughs> Ooh. Say it again. Simba. <laughs> One more time. Simba. <laughs> Simba. <laughs> That's enough. Go on then. See for yourself. Simba is one wishy washy king. Yeah, I bet about now even some of those high and mighty lionesses were wishing they'd gotten themselves a different king. Gorge, what do you think could have happened? Well, let's go find Simba and see. Tell Simba about this. Wonder if he's up there. You came back. Are you okay? You don't look so good. Hey Simba, why don't we team up and do something about that Scar Ghost? Seems like everybody's worried about it. So now's your big chance to show him what you're really made of. That doesn't concern you! Sorry. It's okay. I just wish I knew what my father would do. But he's not here, Simba. It's all up to you now. And that means the important thing is what you're gonna do being the king, not what your father would have done. So you're saying it's all up to me? See? There you go. Hey, yep, yep, yep. We know your dad was a great king and all, but now it's your turn. Remember what I taught you. You gotta put the past behind you. It's time to go out there and show everybody things are gonna be just fine. Yeah, you can do it. You gotta live for today. And find your own path. 
live for today and find my own path, not my father's. That's it. I'm glad to hear you say that, Simba. <laughs> Promise me you'll help Simba any way you can. As long as Sora handles a dangerous part. I'm counting on you, Simba. And so is our baby. Great, now we're gonna have to babysit! <laughs> <laughs> Let's go see Rafiki first. I'm sure he'll be able to tell us something about that ghost. Whoa! Ah, come on! Can't you guys just leave us alone? Do you three know anything about Scar's ghost? Huh? Scar's ghost? <laughs> Maybe. You do know! Oh no! I guess you caught us all! What are we gonna do? <laughs> <laughs> Tell me about Scar's ghost! Sorry, we don't know nothing. Oh, wait. It's coming back to me. That's the one that only hangs out around Freddy Cats. Right, Banzai? Enough! <laughs> there it is. <laughs> Must be a Freddy Cat around here somewhere. Simba, do something! How does it feel to be king? Why, you must be a truly inspiring leader by now. After all, you are the son of the great Mufasa. Where are you going? Ah, Simba, running away as always. Simba! <laughs> Gosh, Rafiki was right. You mean, Simba's still unsure? Seems like. Do you think there's some way we can help? Hmm... We should start by talking to Simba some more. Let's head back to the Pride Lands. Father! Hmm, it seems even your daddy has abandoned your house. Simba! It's no use. I'll never be the king my father was. But Simba, that's not what you're supposed to be. You can't be Mufasa. You can only be you. Everybody believes in you as a king. They just want to see what you'll do. And if anyone's saying they liked your father better, it's because you haven't done much yet. That's all. I know that. Then stop moping and do something. I can't. Fine. Let's go, Sora. Yeah. Why stick around if he's not even gonna try? Come on, Goofy. <sighs> the hesitant king will one day lose all his friends. King Simba the Dagger. Worried by a silly old ghost. Ooh, Simba, the do-nothing king. No! Quiet, stop me! You did it! The ghost is gone! We knew you could do it! Hooray for Simba! You know, I'm really lucky to have friends who stand by me and help me see clearly. My father wasn't so fortunate. There you go again. I mean, everyone here and in the Pride Land wants me to succeed. 
Sora, Donald, and Goofy. Pumba, Timon, Rafiki, Nala. You all want what's best for me. But my father always has Scar lurking behind his back, trying to cut him down. I've got to make the most of my blessings and rebuild this kingdom. Are you gonna say it or do it? Wait and see. Simba! <laughs> Simba, come quick! There's a bazillion ghosts of Scar haunting the Pride Lands. Everybody but Nala hightailed it out of there. And now she needs your help. Uh, our little Simba, all grown up and finding his place in the world. Nice try. You're coming too. We're here. Where's Simba? I've come back, Nala. Get out. Way to go, Simba! Are you with me? Now and forever, your majesty. Simba seems fine now. Ha! The king has returned. The Pride Lands will not forget King Simba's courage, or the courage of those who fought beside him. Do you think your quest will ever be over? I don't know. But I think, as long as the Keyblade stays with me, I'll have to keep fighting. Ah, the struggle never ends. That is the great circle of life. Never ever? The secret to victory is a strong heart. Go on, go on, go, go then! <laughs> go on, get out! Yes, yes, it is time! Your fight continues! Till we meet again, your majesty. I hope that's soon. It will be. So long. Wait a sec. I thought everything was supposed to be under control here. Must be Organization 13 again. We better go see Leon. He went on over to Ansem's study to find out what all the ruckus was about.
Turns out the MCP is using the data in that computer to crank out Heartless. MCP's been messing around with the town's control system, too. That MCP sure doesn't know when to quit, does it? We'll be there soon, Tron. Okay. Me too. Let's head for the game grid. Great. The terminal works. Let's go. Finished. Would be, if it weren't for the old loon's magic. Old loon, you say? I'm trying to work here. No, <laughs> I'll show you who's old. Done! Yeah! There you go, Leon. One homemade program. A loony wizard special. This had better work. I'm off. You'd be on your guard. Warning. User control is terminated indefinitely. <sighs> no good. Leon, let me try. This is your final warning. Stop at once. Bon appétit. Don't talk with your mouth full. What? What are you loading? Nothing's come in yet. 
Leon, come on! There. All right. What's it like? This is very strange. That's my truck! Huh? There's a power booster for me. And flight routines for the solar sailor. Meaning, we're set? Well, like you users say, we won't know till we give it a try. We'll need a sailor to reach the MCP, so let's get to the simulation hangar. You've got to keep a lookout. The MCP isn't going to just let us waltz in. The MCP is straight ahead. Time to settle things for good. You're very persistent, Tron. I'm also better than you. Uh, we would have made a great team. Now for the MCP. This thing is the MCP? That's it. Ugly, isn't it? Tom, don't you understand? We don't need users. We've advanced. They're superfluous. Be a part of me, and together the world will be ours to control. MCP, you still don't get it, do you? Sark! Sark! All my functions are now yours!
We did it! I see Tron has a silly side, too. I learned it from you. Of course, I do have my silly limits. Okay, then I'll tweak your program when I get back to the user world. You? Maybe we better not try that. Aw, <laughs> how about it, guys? Singing Tron? Dancing Tron. Sound good? <laughs> okay, okay, fine. But before I crash... Sora, Donald, Goofy, and all the users out there, thank you. You really helped me. You made me so much stronger. You taught me what friendship is truly all about. And I'll never forget it. As soon as I met you, I knew we were going to defeat the MCP and free the system. Uh, uh... Isn't this what users do when they're sorry to say goodbye? Uh, it's a first for me. Gorse, Tron, it's like a promise that we'll see each other again real soon. Okay, well then. down in town. The only Heartless left anywhere are the local variety. And it looks like there are fewer than before. Now if we can just get those three back in one piece... You're here! Welcome back! How's the town? A-OK! -okay. Not a single trace of the MCP either. Everything's back to normal. We made it. Hey, why the long face? What happened? Tron just disappeared! And he promised we'd see him again. Run! What's happening? Greetings, friends. System is up and ready for user input. Tron! Tron! Stay in touch. Yeah. And boy, oh boy! Hey, stop that. It tickles. Tron is ticklish? How about this? Please, stop that. <laughs> <laughs> I think Tron's been hanging around those guys too much. Wait, wait, just a moment. I want to show you something I dug up from the system archives. You can see the town back when it was first built. That's right. I remember now. Just like the old days. Hmm. I'd be fascinated to ascertain as to when the town got such a dreadful name as Hollow Bastion. You know, 
This town had another name once. Hmm? Radiant Garden. What is Cloud doing? Beats me. Hmm. By the way, you three, who are you? Well, I'm not sure we should tell you. Well, that's an interesting sword you're carrying. It's the Keyblade! I see. So that's a Keyblade. And I suppose you must be its chosen wielder. So what if I am? I wonder if it won't change its mind once I defeat you. How'd you like that? I admit you're very skilled. But apparently Cloud is the only one who can eliminate me. <laughs> Tell Cloud to come here. Tell him Sephiroth is looking to settle things. Did you give him my message? Maybe. Sorry to keep you, Sephiroth. Cloud. You'll never let go of the darkness. Shut up. You'll never let go of your past. Shut up! Cloud! Get him! Absurd. Defeating me is meaningless. You know that more than anyone, Cloud. No matter how many times I fall, your darkness keeps calling me back. Wrong! People, stay back! How can I? I want to help you! You can't. He'll never let go of the darkness. He doesn't have to. He just needs someone to surround him with light. Darkness will be there, Sephiroth, but in a place you can't reach. Is that right? Let's see what this light of yours can do. They go. Do you think they made it back to their own world? They went somewhere else. Cloud went to fight a great battle to defeat the darkness inside him. Gone again. What will you do now? Hmm. Guess I'll keep looking. Got any leads? Don't worry. Light is easy to find. I gotta go. Here, this is for helping me out. But wait, when did we help? Hey, I think we're almost there. Huh? 
scores. Aren't we here because of the picture? Look, I'll show you. Wow, look at this Come on, let's go find this mansion. Yeah. Hey, are you all right? What happened? We came here looking for Kyrie. Then those white things attacked us. You're going to be careful. Yeah, you guys didn't have to go and do that. Of course we did. Kyrie's our friend too, you know. You're right. You know, I never thought of it like that before. Word is, this mansion gets a lot of really strange visitors. We thought this place might be the gateway to some kind of alternate Twilight Town. What do you mean, alternate Twilight Town? Hey Goofy, do you think we could see that crystal of yours? I made that pouch myself, and I still have it. So, there shouldn't be two of them here. And this is the trophy Cypher gave you. You left it behind, remember? It's the only one of its kind. Same for the crystals. Red, blue, yellow, green. Only one of each color. But you've got your own. So, where'd you get it? Um... The pouch is from the king. When he gave us money for the train ride, he gave us the crystal too. But then, where did the king get it? See? There's gotta be another town out there like this one. That would explain how the king got that pouch and the crystal. Everything makes sense. It does? That other town must be where whatever's missing from here went. Like Kyrie. I get it. I got something to tell you. I found out where Ansem is. Ansem the Wise. The real Ansem. He snuck into Organization 13 Stronghold. And we've figured out where Kyrie is. I'm pretty sure we're right. But why'd you all come here? Someone gave us a clue. Who? Well, Your Majesty, Sora thinks it might have been Riku. It's just a feeling I had. Well, if that's what you think, then it's probably right. You mean Riku's okay? If that's what you think. I've waited long enough, Your Majesty. Tell me what you know. It's not for me to say. But Your Majesty, why? I don't want to break my promise. You made a promise to Riku? So he's okay. I can see him again. Huh? Who's Riku? My best friend. That's it. Your Majesty, you got the pouch with the crystal from Riku, didn't you? And you promised not to tell, right? Gosh, guys. That's enough! Yeah, let's go. Kairi, Riku, we're on our way. There! We found it! How does it work? I can handle it. Okay, here we go. Oh, what's wrong? I can't go any further without a password. Do you have any idea what the password might be? Mm. Well, we only got this photo. <laughs> yeah, the one Donald ate up. It was in the box right next to the photo. Hey, that's it! Ansem the Wise loved ice cream! Okay, what's the name of the flavor? It worked! Let's go! 
We'll be here to hold down the fort. Say hi to Kyrie. You bet. Are we back in the same place? Work! This is the other Twilight Town. Roxas's Twilight Town. There's gotta be an entrance into the Dark Realm somewhere. Let's split up. This is it! What is this place? Wow, well, which way should we go? Riku! Kairi! Or the darkness will overtake you. Get going! Why? Don't ask, just do it! You okay? I kidnapped Kairi, but she got away from me. After that, Syax caught her. He's a member of Organization 13. Syax, got it memorized? Now go save her! Leave us alone! I think I liked it better when they were on my side. Feeling a little regret? Nah, I can handle these punks. <laughs> Watch this. You're... fading away. Well... That's what happens when you put your whole being into an attack. You know what I mean? Not that nobody's actually have beings, right? Anyway, I digress. Go. Find Kyrie. Oh. Almost forgot. Sorry for what I did to her. When we find her... You can tell her that yourself. Think I'll pass. My heart just wouldn't be in it, you know? I haven't got one. <laughs> Axel, what were you trying to do? I wanted to see Roxas. He... was the only one I liked. He made me feel... like I had a heart. It's kind of funny. You make me feel the same. Kyrie's in the castle dungeon. Now go! Axel. This leads to... Ah, uh, come on, let's get going!
随分と空席が増えちまったなえアクセルの悪あがきを楽しみにしてたのにやたら素直に消えちまうしよ彼は満たされたのかもしれんな己の存在をかけ何かを手に入れたのだろうおいおい俺たちは存在しないのにどうやって存在をかけるんだかけのルールに反してるって話だそうアクセルは存在しないものをかけおそらくは勝ったのだ彼らしい鮮やかなイカ様と思わんかくだらん奴が手に入れたのは無だけだアクセルは心を持たない虚しさに耐えられず心に引き寄せられて破滅した奴は弱かったのだだが弱さによって目覚めるものもある見えるのだよアクセルは空の心を揺さぶった空と共にある彼が目覚めるのではないか。Axel said Kyrie's in the dungeon. Then we better find a way to get to that castle. Why he picked you?
知りたいか君は何も感じない実感できない意味が欲しいか新しい君だ。やっとお目覚めかい。アクセル。いや、眠りにつくのかもな。もうすぐこうして意識だけの会話さえできなくなる。元に元の自分の姿に戻るんだな。ずっと考えてた。ナミネも言ってたんだ。ロクサス、お前には心があるんじゃないか。いや、俺やナミネにも、俺たちには本当に心はないのか。それは。それは俺にもわからない。そうだよな。でも心なんて見えるものじゃない。感じるものじゃないかなって思い始めたんだ。だとしたらいや今はやめとく。あ、なんだよ肝心なとこで。答えは空が見つけるよ。あいつは俺だから。<笑>そうだな。お。<笑>懐かしいな。記憶してるか。初めて会った時、お前に新しい名前がついた日、こうしてここから夕日を見たんだ。ああ、俺の故郷だ。みんな、ハイネ、ピンツ、オレット、元気かな。また会いに行けばいいさ。答えを探しにな。うん。だから、もう行かなくちゃ。空が待ってる。ああ。そうだな。<笑>やっぱこのアイスしょっぱいな。またな、アクセル。またな、相棒。You make a good other. You make a good other. Are you okay? What just happened? Gorge, I don't know. You just disappeared. Then me and Donald had to fight some nobodies. Oh. He said he defeated Riku. Who said that? That guy in the black coat. But nobody can defeat Riku. Y yeah, you're right. A black coat means Organization 
He must have been trying to trick you. Yeah, that must be why we didn't see him. Huh? You must be tired, Sora. Come on, let's just find a way to get into that castle. Dead end? There's gotta be a path somewhere! to do with us you're the fire that feeds Sora's anger no Sora's in danger because of me Almost there. Kyrie, where are you? Shh. Remember where we are. This is their stronghold. Right. Your Majesty. Be careful. I think we got company. Afraid leaving is not an option. I'll take you to see Sora. You don't want that. I do. More than anything. But not with you around. If I had a heart, this would be where I'd die of laughter. You. Didn't Roxas take care of you? You can take it from here, Riku. Riku? Sora, 
You've done well. Where's Kyrie? Who knows? I expect she's catching up with her friend from the darkness. What do you mean? She doesn't need you anymore. I'm supposed to believe that? Well, you don't have to. But you can believe this. Organization 13 has no further use for you. Just look there. Our kingdom hearts. Thanks to you, we've collected countless hearts. Can you hear their euphoria? Now all they need is one more helping from the Keyblade Bearer. Kingdom Hearts! Sora! Sora, it's really you! Kyrie! Huh? You leave Sora alone! Sora is completely hopeless without us. Come on, Riku. Well, well. Will the intrusions never end? This castle is perfect. Perhaps we should uh, acquire it. Well, the setup is, is kind of nice, I guess. But what about all the heartless? Oh, this in-between world, it, it's way too close to the darkness. They ain't gonna listen to us here. Once again, you underestimate me. It's been too long, my friend. Ansem the Wise? Why didn't you come to me before things got so bad? Zemnus, the organization superior, is the nobody of Xehanort, my foremost apprentice. The burden was mine to bear. Is that all? I won't deny there was more. I was obsessed with thoughts of revenge. My apprentices stole everything precious to me. My research and my pride. I can't help you with revenge. I know. Riku's told me a thousand times. Where is he? He must be with his friends by now. Riku was a great help to me. I found him wandering the darkness after you and he lost track of each other. Gosh, we didn't lose each other exactly. Riku left, well, because Xehanort's Heartless was still inside his heart, troubling him. And he sure must have been suffering. But what I don't understand is why he looks like that now, when he's still Riku at heart. 
I am to blame. When I met Riku the first time, he still had the appearance of a boy. Probably because he had such a strong heart. I asked him to find a young man named Roxas from Organization 13 and bring him to me. When I told him it would help Sora awaken from his slumber, Riku left without a word. He fought Roxas, and I can only surmise Riku lost that fight. Riku must have realized then, to fight in the realm of darkness, he would have to immerse himself in that same darkness. And when he did, you saw what became of him. When Riku brought Roxas back to me, he was introducing himself as handsome. If that was what it took to awaken his friend, he was ready to live in darkness. Riku was the victim of my revenge. Oh, how my heart ached. I could only laugh to hide my shame. I guess it must have been after that when I saw Riku again. He said he wanted to help Sora, but he made me promise. Promise that Sora wouldn't ever find out about what happened to him while he was out in the darkness. My friend, the time has come. I must make amends to these young people. A good boy. Show yourself. Oh, it sounds like you haven't. Sora, Roxas. Roxas? Hey, did he just call me Roxas? You really put Organization 13 in a pickle. I guess that must be why the Keyblade chose you. But man, did it pick a dud this time. You don't look like you're half the hero the others were. Are you done rambling? Rambling? As if. All I'm trying to tell you, traitor, is that your time is up. Here he comes! Why did you call me Roxas? <laughs> Wouldn't you like to know? Hey, hold on! Sora, I'm friends! Uh-oh, they need our help! Sora and Rico are together. We have no part to play here. Gee, I wonder if Riku will ever change back. Riku chose that form so he could use the power of darkness. It won't be easy. Kairi, we're on our way. Yes. Kingdom Hearts. 
Rejoice and feast on these hearts we offer. Shine your pale light on this empty realm. Share your power with all nobodies. Xemnas, is Kingdom Hearts ready? Very soon. Then I can end this charade? Indeed. How I've waited to hear that. Tiny, you are great! Oh? <laughs> You are different, Kyrie, but I'm just glad you're here. You and Riku never came home, so I came looking for you. I'm sorry. This is real. Wait, Ansem! I mean, Xehanort's heartless. I never thought for a second that I'd ever see you again. Just thinking about all the things you did makes me really mad. But... But you saved Kairi, right? I have to be grateful for that. Thanks. Riku, don't go! Huh? Oh? Kairi, what did you just say? Riku. I'm no one, just a castaway from the darkness. Sora, come here. Say something to him. Here. You'll understand. Close your eyes. Riku! It's Riku. Riku's here. I looked for you. Come on, Sora. You've got to pull it together. I looked everywhere for you! I didn't want you to find me. But it was him that was helping us, wasn't it? Huh? Those clues we kept finding. That must have been Riku. I was starting to worry you guys weren't ever going to catch on. Sora never did pick the brightest friends. What do you mean by that? Why didn't you let me know you were okay? I told you. I didn't want to be found. Not like this. I couldn't. I fought with Ansem, with Xanort's Heartless. When it invaded my heart and I won. But to use the power of darkness, I had to become handsome myself. Does that mean you can't change back? This battle isn't over. And until it is, I still need the power of darkness. Then, let's finish it. You're still Riku, no matter what. So how about it? Think we can handle one last rumble together? The king's waiting. Yeah! Let's get going! This spot should do.
this gadget for? It's a device to reclaim Kingdom Hearts and encode it as data. Not sure I get it. I do not claim to know the outcome of this venture either. After all, hearts are unpredictable. What's that? It's the King and Diz. I mean, Ansem the Wise. They must be higher up. We better hurry. You! I'd rather we just skip the formalities. How could you, Roxas? That Sora! You okay? Yeah, no worries. Let's keep moving. Only you could have made it this far in one piece, Roxas. That's really getting old! Different name, same fate. My heart. I don't get it. Why has everybody been calling me Roxas? Because, Sora. Roxas is your nobody. My... Nobody? But that's crazy! I never turned into a heart... Oh... Right. It was when you came to rescue me. Remember? Xemnas was the one who found Roxas. He could use the Keyblade because he was your nobody. That's why Xemnas brought him into the organization. But Roxas betrayed them. After that I fought him because I thought it would help you wake up. I lost. But the next time we met, I made sure I was the stronger one. Maybe I didn't need to fight him after all. I think he left the organization because he really wanted to meet you. Roxas. I wish I could meet him too. Let's go. Hey! 
handsome? <laughs> I'm a fool. I spent years studying the workings of the heart. Yet it seems I still haven't learned a thing. What do you mean? The process of encoding hearts is incalculable. The inhabitants of my twilight town were data created from real hearts. I was convinced that they would think and behave the way I had envisioned, but I couldn't have been more wrong. A heart is so much more than any system. I saw it when Roxas and Kyrie crossed paths. I knew, but I was too stubborn to accept it. It's always the same. I try to wrap my mind around things my heart already knows, only to fail. While I was trying to bring Sora back, I had so many plans in store. But once Sora was an acting force, they fell apart. All my research amounted to nothing compared with that one boy's heart. And some a machine! All the more proof that hearts cannot be contained by data. Run, my friend! It's going to self-destruct, and anything could happen. What? Your Majesty! Sora, the rest is up to you. And Roxas, I doubt you can hear me, but I am sorry. Handsome! My heart is telling me what I must do. Please allow me to do what it says. No! Riku! His heart's decided. We can't change that. I was wondering who would dare interfere with my kingdom hearts. And look, here you all are. How convenient for me. Ansem the Wise. You look pathetic. Have your love. I deserve as much for failing to see you for the fool you are. Students do take after their teachers. Only a fool would be your apprentice. After all, none of this would have happened without you. You are the source of all Heartless. It was your research that inspired me to go further than you ever dared. I admit, my disregard brought chaos to more worlds than one. But what were you seeking? You erased me from the world, only to take my name and continue research better left forgotten. Is this the answer you've been looking for? All that and more. I'm carrying on what you yourself began, and I'm creating a brand new world. One heart at a time. I thought you'd praise me, but all you ever do is hold me back. I understand, though. Unlike me, you have a heart, and you're powerless to control it, consumed by the jealousy you feel toward the student who surpassed you. They are not. Foolish apprentice of a foolish man. You have surpassed nothing. Only proved how little we both know. We may profess to know the heart, but its essence is beyond our reach. We're both ignorant. As oblivious as when we began. I'm afraid that any world you try to create any world of yours would be an empire of ignorance. That is why you and your creation are destined to fall. We've said enough. Rico, you know what to do. King Mickey, my friend, forgive me. Farewell!
Riku! Huh? Uh, uh, uh. Riku! did say anything could happen. Riku, you gonna take that off? Oh. What was that? His eyes couldn't lie. Lie? And just who were you trying to fool? Huh? Huh? Myself. Riku, come on, man. Why did you try to do so much on your own? You've got friends, like us. Have you forgotten? I'll tell you why. Because I'm not a total sap like you. Say that again! <coughs> what should we do, Riku? We must defeat Xemnas. He's the organization's last survivor. Right! Come on. Sora! Riku! There's gonna be no end to this! Together we can stop them. <laughs> We're gone from here. Leave these creatures to us. But there's no way we could take them all. I will be sending them after Xemnas. Or perhaps you would rather fight them yourself. Frankly, my dear, I'd rather run! Off with you then. Well, if it ain't the boat boy key. Time to weigh anchor, Captain Pete. What, like abandoned ship? I don't think so. Sora, your majesty, do not forget. When I've destroyed them all, this castle shall be mine. Now looky here. Opportunities like this don't come along every day, you know. We gotta hurry. But... They're doing what their hearts command. We can't interfere. of the Keyblade. Go forth and bring me more hearts. No! Denizens of Light, answer this. Why do you hate the darkness? Huh, we don't hate it. It's just kind of scary. But the world's made of light and darkness. You can't have one without the other, because darkness is half of everything. 
sort of makes you wonder why we are scared of the dark. It's because of who's lurking inside it. Then allow me another question. You accept darkness, yet choose to live in the light. So why is it that you loathe us who teeter on the edge of nothing? We who were turned away by both light and dark, never given a choice. That's simple. It's because you mess up our world. That may be. However, what other choice might we have had? Just give it a rest. You're nobodies. You don't even exist. You're not sad about anything. <laughs> Very good. You don't miss a thing. I cannot feel sorrow. No matter what misery befalls the worlds, no matter what you think, what you feel, or how you exist. Zemnus. Hear me, Kingdom Hearts. It seems we must begin anew. Ah, but know this. I will give to you as many hearts as it takes. Mark my words. You can no more be complete without me than I without you. Heed me, Kingdom Hearts. Lend me your power so that we may be complete. The power to erase the fools that hinder us. Goodness! No! Hearts quivering with hatred. Zemnus, don't! Hearts burning with rage. Heart scarred by envy. That fool Ansem said the heart's true nature was beyond his understanding. But it's not beyond mine. Hearts are the source of all power. Zemnus! You can't hide from us! We're not gonna let him get away now! Look at that! What's going on? Kingdom Hearts! Let's go. Zemnus must be inside. The worlds gave us this doorway. They want us to be the guardians of their destiny. Mm. Once we go through, there's no turning back. It's victory or oblivion. So, Sora, are you ready? Get ready, Zemnus. It all ends here.
So, it seems your hearts have led you to obliteration. Perhaps it doesn't pay to be too loyal to one's heart. I will have to be sure and remember that. No! We can take him on our own! I need more rage. I need more hearts. Xemnas, there's more to a heart than just anger or hate. It's full of all kinds of feelings. Don't you remember? Unfortunately, I don't. <laughs> oh, gosh, you all did great. You're coming back with us, right? I had given in to the darkness. Riku! How am I gonna face everyone? Like this? <laughs> I'll open a path. Huh? Oh. You don't belong in the Dark Realm anymore, Riku. How do we get out of here, Your Majesty? Hmm. Sure. But we better hurry and get through. Wait for me! Thank you, Naminé. Sure. See? We meet again, like we promised. Huh? You said we'd meet again. But when we did, we might not recognize each other. I did, didn't I? But I knew you. Hmm, it's strange. I think I understand. I see myself the way you remember me. And you see yourself the way I remember you. I always thought nobodies were doomed to fade back into darkness. Yeah. But you and I did it. We got to meet our original selves. So... we can be together again. Right. Anytime Sora and Kyrie are together. We'll be together every day. Right, Sora? Uh... yeah. Look sharp! Uh, huh? Don't worry. You're all still you. Hey! Let's go home! Riku, 
Come on, yeah. Heroes from the realm of light. I will not allow it to end this way. Not yet. If light and darkness are eternal, then surely we nothings must be the same. Eternal. You're right. Light and darkness are eternal. Nothing probably goes on forever too. But guess what, Xemnas? That doesn't mean you're eternal! <laughs> no more eternal than that radiance of yours. Too sure of that. <sighs> Sora. I can't. Don't say another word. It's not over. It's just not. How can you say that? Even if we could go on. Look where we are. Aw, oh, come on, Riku. You've been hanging out in darkness too long. You gotta try and think positive. 
Sora? Hmm? You lead. Got it. You know? I always figured I was better at stuff than you. Really? Hmm. Are you mad? No. I kinda always thought you were better at everything, too. Riku, look! What's that light? End of the road. Yep. Put me down. I can walk. You know, maybe the darkness has gotten to me too. Riku! This world is perfect for me. If this is what the world really is, just this, then maybe I should fade back into darkness. Riku. If the world is made of light and darkness, we'll be the darkness. Yeah. The other side. The realm of light is safe now. Kyrie, the king, and the others are there. That's what I mean. Hey, Sora. Could you help me? I want to get down to the water. At least the waves sound the same. What I said back there, about thinking I was better at stuff than you? Mm -hmm. To tell you the truth, Sora, I was jealous of you. What for? I wished I could live life the way you do. Just following my heart. Yeah, well, I've got my share of problems too. Like what? Like wanting to be like you. Hmm. Well, there is one advantage to being me. Something you can never imitate. Really? What's that? Having you for a friend. Then I guess... I'm okay the way I am. I've got something you could never imitate, too. Sora? Hmm? I think it's for you. Thinking of you wherever you are. We pray for our sorrows to end. And hope that our hearts will blend. Now I will step forward to realize this wish. And who knows? Starting a new journey may not be so hard. Or maybe it's already begun. There are many worlds. But 
they share the same sky. One sky. One destiny. Light. The door to light. We'll go together. Yeah. i 
Nothing's changed, huh? Nope. Nothing will. What a small world. But... part of one that's much bigger. Yeah. Hey, Riku. What do you think it was? The door to the light. <laughs> this. This? Yeah. It's always closer than you think. Hey, what's up? Look. From the king? 